Hello, if you've been experiencing this error in your Roblox, then you're in the right video. So I'm going to show you how you can fix that. So you have to go and type CMD, CMD, and then you right click on it and you run it as administrator. Run as administrator. So from here, we are going to enter a set of commands in order to in order for you to be able to have this error fixed. So the first one is this one and you make sure that you follow each of them the way they are so that you don't miss a, any step. So after doing all this, you're going to restart your PC and then you run your Roblox and that's how successfully it shall be fixed. So the first one is this one. I'm going to be popping them on the screen so that you'll be able to see them clearly. And in case you don't get my accent very well, you can turn on CC so that you activate subtitles. So after the first one, then you enter the second one. So all these are to help you uh, customize these settings such that after running them, your Roblox is also able to perform very well. So the second one is uh, this one. As I said, I'll be popping them on the screen so that you are able to see them clearly. And then you enter. So successfully reset the Winstock catalog. So in order for that to apply, you have to reset your PC. And then after resetting it, you're going to come to this other side. Let's assume you have reset your PC already. So you're going to close this. And then you go and change the internet settings also. So you reset, you restart your PC. And then you go to the internet settings so even this we're going to change some adapter settings so that it's able to match the protocol to use so you go to all settings and then you come to network and internet so from there you come to change adapter options change adapter options after that if you're connected to ethernet that's what you're going to customize the changes are going to apply to that ethernet uh, setup so you right click on it then you come to properties from properties you scroll to this other option i hope this is clear and you're following me so you come to this option and then you right click on it then you I mean you come to properties so for the first one you leave it the way it is then for the second one you use the following uh, option so you're going to select the second option and then for the first one you're going to enter these values 1 1 1 1 so it's one throughout then even for the second one that's the same thing you're going to do 1 1 I mean one zero zero one and then you click OK so after clicking OK you make sure you you're going to close it the first one was one throat OK then close so then that is done and you'll be able to run your rollbook successfully so then the other thing is uh, to delete all the temporary files you come to hashtag hash temp hash so that you're able to see all the temporary files and you delete them hash temp hash and then you click OK in order, I mean you click enter in order to open and then you, se you select all then hold the windows key and I mean the shift key and the delete key at the same time in order to delete this so I hope this has worked for you and in case it does, please make sure to subscribe so that you don't miss the next videos. And if it doesn't, I'll up update another video that can help you have this error fixed. So thanks for watching 
and don't forget to check these other videos on the left and right at the end of this very video and also comment and see you in the next video bye bye